All good things have to come to an end. Goodbye, Mexico. Today is our travel home from Cancun to Orlando. It's a relatively easy flight, about two hours, and we'll be back. We're going back to cold weather, 50 degrees, 40 degrees, which will be a nice change. It'll kind of feel like Christmas since it is going to be December. But I'm welcome back to your daily dose, everybody. We're excited to travel home, you know? Travel vlogs are always really fun to film. And we're going to attempt to get global entry inside MCO in Orlando. We'll kind of document that experience to see how it all works. Because if you come from um, out of the country, you can actually do a walk-up reservation or like just a walk-up. You don't need a reservation to get global entry. So we're going to kind of see how this whole process works. Most importantly, you know, get home safe. We're gonna have some breakfast here this morning down below here at the Coral Level in Cancun at Bureau Star. Huge shout out to Bureau Star. And of course, just, you know, travel home. So, with that, welcome back to your daily dose, everybody. Yes. Take it or leave it. This might be it. bad news for you, good news for some of you guys. Ow, my back just hurts. Woo, I'm getting old. Our flight just got delayed about an hour. Um, on travel days, I'm kind of like indifferent. Like, I want to get back. I don't want to get back. But the problem is we have a pickup already scheduled at 11.20. And, you know, boarding wasn't going to be until about, like, 3.20 now. So it's, like, four hours in the airport. We're trying to get that kind of situated and figured out right now to see if we can delay that. Because I'd rather sit here than a hotel. Totally butchered that. I'd rather sit in a hotel, all-inclusive hotel, than an airport. I don't want to leave this. Oh, cloudy weather today. It's also very breezy out. Unfortunately, we didn't see any turtles. No turtles. It would've been cool. The secret way to getting everything to fit is to sit on it. Oh boy. The delays keep getting worse and worse. Now it's delayed until 4.16. This could be a travel day, a travel day nightmare. What, what, what did you just say? I said, why does this keep happening when like a plane, when like our flights get delayed, they just like keep delaying and delaying and delaying. It's like every 10 minutes I get a notification. You just got, you got delayed more now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It so got delayed. Now we leave at, we leave at 5.04 now. We were originally supposed to leave at 2.30. <laughs> I guess the good news is that the global entry is open until midnight, but now I think we're gonna have to get a whole new car because our transfer over to the, to the hotel because I'm not leaving here at 11. Just at the airport for like four hours now, five hours. Ay, ay, ay. All right, let's go eat. Awesome. Well, I've got semi good news. Lomas has uh, contacted me or our car company who's transferring us on over um, actually said that they're gonna pick us up a little bit later now because of the delays and they're gonna continue to monitor it, which is really nice. So we have that going for us. And it's not like the airport's so far away. So that's why we're not really too like, oh my gosh, we, we need to get a ride three hours early. It's pretty much right down the road. Elevator has arrived. Yeah, let's go all the way down. Morning buffet. Let's see what they have. Oh my gosh. This is our first time having breakfast here. It's kind of sad. Charcuterie. Oh my gosh, breakfast sandwich. Oh, look at that. I gotta grab one. So far, my selections. Breakfast seems like the place to be here. Oh my goodness. Caprese. Looks like we have like three different kinds of eggs benedict, just with the, the dressing or the sauce. We got some traditional Mexican eggs here as well. And of course, if you want to get some uh, breakfast beef fajitas, be our guest, be your guest actually. But if you didn't want to do that, you can also get your uh, really fresh eggs and tacos made here on the grill too. So it's like fresh versions versus non-fresh versions. Cheese fingers. Oh my gosh, give me this. Chorizo. I'm actually kind of blown away with how much options or how many options there are for breakfast. We've got French toast, we've got crepes, we've got pancakes, churros, fresh waffles. I don't know what that is, but that looks good. I gotta try it all. And we also have a donut wall. 
breakfast. How did we miss this? Well, we just ran out of time, honestly. All I gotta say, if you know, you know, use the tongs. Here's a look at my breakfast. Still probably gonna go back to get some more since we have so much time now. We have breakfast with or view. It's pretty breezy this morning. I'm gonna be American and try the hash brown first. I'll take 20 more of these. That hash brown gives McDonald's a run for its money. And now I gotta try the chorizo. Two um, good options right there. And of course I had to, had to get two mimosas. Had to get two. Cheers. Cheers. To our travel day that has been delayed. Yes. Also, wait till you try that hash brown. Mm, mango. That is really good. I was gonna say that it tastes super fresh. Got a mango. Mm. If you come here, do not miss out on breakfast. The French toast. Just tried that. Everything has been delicious. Don't make the same mistake we did and skip breakfast. Breakfast is like the Mockingjay. Katniss Everdeen. It's catching fire. It is fire. That was a good one, right? I think that was a good one. I cannot believe that this is our first time having breakfast here this morning on our last day. Because this is by far my favorite meal that I've had here at the resort. Everything is so fresh and delicious and there's so many options. This is also just the coral level one. They do have the selection buffet too that will probably have more. This is just supposed to be a little bit of a, t a higher tier level. At least the good news is now we get to actually try some more lunch because, you know, flights late till five, don't have to leave until like what? One or two o'clock, lunch starts at one. We got all the time in the world. No stress today. Casey just told me she's trying to get through this. But why? If you don't like it, don't drink it. Because it's green. Because it's green. <laughs> it must be good for me, right? <laughs> it probably is. Green juice don't taste good. Breakfast was good. We're gonna head this way real quick. It's so breezy. No wonder our flight's delayed. The plane can't probably like make it through here. <laughs> I think that's the case. Believe it or not, there's one section of the hotel we really haven't showed you guys, and it's kind of the activity center, center in a way. Oh wow, there's actually people utilizing it. We thought there wasn't anybody, but there's some nice wow. courts down here. Also, the fountain's usually on, but I think they turn it off during the day when it's very breezy out, because otherwise it would go over the, the valet. It really is breezy out, but it feels so good. And I think my mic does a pretty, pretty good job at kind of like deflecting the wind. It's, it's, a, it's a very good mic, but here's a look at the hotel from the front, the selection. Goodbye, Cancun. No. I know. I know. I always hate this part. This part does stink, but you know what doesn't? Look at this. They have tennis courts over here and they're actually doing lessons. I didn't know you could do that. I don't really even know how to play tennis and I want to know. How nice. Oh my gosh. This guy was just chill in here. I think we can walk past him, but that is a big iguana. Wow, that scared me. It's like the lizards. It's like the lizards of Florida. You can do it. It's just a giant lizard. You got a case? You didn't even move. <laughs> We're trying to get to one other section because there's actually a soccer field right next to this place over there. And here's the tennis courts. However, thankfully Casey has notifications on, this has never, ever, ever, ever in the history of mankind happened to me. Comment down below if this has ever happened to you. But our travel day has just gone backwards. Our flight just got undelayed. And I'm actually blown away because it just delayed from five o'clock back to, what was it, 2.30? Yeah. So that's actually a huge difference. So we <laughs> didn't make sure that our our van pickup is Still gonna accurate. come. And we need to kind of hurry it up a little bit. Has that ever happened to you guys? <laughs> Your flight got delayed and then got undelayed. It's like they probably sent another plane over, but that's never, ever happened to me, oh ever. Goodness. I'm not, I mean, I'm sad because I was kind of getting used to the idea of being able to yeah. eat lunch here and spend a little bit more time. At the same time, I do have to work tomorrow, so 
the thought of like being delayed more was kind of stressing me out a little bit. So we should be good. What? <laughs> okay, I guess we're leaving earlier now. Has that ever happened to you guys? Let's, I guess we gotta get going because we have like an hour. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. All right, well, goodbye Cancun earlier than we thought. We'll be back here. Ay ay ay. Side note, by the way, they have a lot of these refilling stations throughout the resorts, so you can always get fresh water. Check that out. There's a dance class here in the morning. You know, I would have said we would have done that, but our flight's on time now. You think we would have done that? Oh, totally. Totally, guys. Sorry, we can't dance. <laughs> Gotta catch no, our flight it's, now. It's not the dancing part, it's the working out part. We, we tend to do a lot of that, huh? We work out a lot. So much. There is, like, nobody in the pool right now. Wow, what's up? Honestly, so comfortable. It's so squishy. Is this first come, first serve? I think so. Yeah, it doesn't even look like reserved or anything. Nobody's here. That's, That's nice. Huh. I had to come see this for one last time. See you later, Cancun. We love you. We think no one's here because the bar isn't open yet, which is a pretty good, pretty good guess. Casey's writing our housekeeper a note. So sad. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Womp womp. Always the worst part, without doubt. Or a quick ride to the front. Gracias, senor. It's good to see our La Machia travel agency vehicle here again. Again, huge shout out. Link will be down below. Anything you guys need travel wise, La Machia will hook it up. Until next time. Here we go. Our flight is now delayed again, but only by about 15 minutes. Let's hope it just stays 15 minutes delayed. It's 11.40 right now, so cross our fingers. Well, we're gonna cross our fingers. It doesn't get delayed anymore, but this is the weirdest thing that's ever happened to me. I mean, flights get delayed all the time. Don't get me wrong, I know that, but I've never had it really, like, happen as much as it has this morning. Oh, JetBlue. Wow, a lot of traffic. I think it's gonna rain, too. Oh wow, they're gonna open our doors? That's so kind. Hi guys! Hello. Where are you guys going to? I'm Jeff. I'm your Lomas travel representative. Oh nice, Lomas actually has someone here to escort us in too. That's super nice. Super helpful. They're actually here explaining us where to go. And they can take us up if we, if we uh, want it, but we were like, ah, oh, it's okay, we're gonna... And if you need to print a boarding pass, they'll also take you over to the ticket counter and help you with that process as well. I was not expecting to be greeted like that when we arrived here. They're phenomenal. Airport is way busier today than when we arrived. But the big question is, are we gonna keep getting delayed? I don't know. We'll find out. Travel day, travel day. It is a travel day. Wow. Cancun is packed. We're not checking any bags, just going through security. Thank goodness. Yeah, this is a zoo. To be honest, that's probably why your transfer was booked for so early, because they might expect that you have to check bags. That could be it. Honestly. They anticipated it was going to be very crowded. Look at this. I thought that it was the security line, but no, that is to check bags. It pays to travel lights. Let's go. <laughs>
Wow. I'm sure it moves quick, but wow, I did not expect that at all. I got a guacamole grill here. Hopefully they have some good food on the other side because we're going to have like two hours, three hours to spare. More like two and a half. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I thought this sign said solo passengers only. Ay, 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 KP. Ay, ay, ay. I'm not really stressed because we're here at the airport. I feel like the only thing I'm stressed about is seeing if this flight keeps getting more and more delayed, but it's not the end of the world what happens. But it is if we don't get back before midnight because we obviously want to get global entry and see how that all works. Hopefully we get that today too. You may be asking why we want global entry. I mean, I think it's kind of self-explanatory. You know, Casey gets TSA pre with that. And then of course, whenever we travel out of the country, bing bada boom, we get in right away. No lines. So far, it doesn't seem like the security is really backed up. It's just to check your bags. That is a zoo. Depends which airline you're at though. Frontier wasn't so bad. Oh yeah, this is not bad. Not bad at all. That took all of five minutes. Very efficient, but definitely if you're checking bags, get here early. We got like two and a half hours. That was so efficient. You wanna go shop? 40% off some cologne and perfume. I'm sure this Patron is 46 bucks. Oh, that's not bad. It's a little markdown, right? Lots of liquor. Lots of liquor. But there's a lot of people asking us to stop on by and buy stuff. Honestly, it's really not that bad though. They're all really friendly. I will say that's what I usually, I don't stop and shop is because I don't really like to kind of sit here and get pressured into buy something. So that's why I usually kind of walk by stuff all the time, especially in airports or when we're in a different country. That's why I always just keep on walking. A lot of food. Also, look at all these Christmas decorations. These things are really cool. 42 pesos. Last second souvenirs. Nice shirts too. Cancun shirts. As Casey was saying, this place is a lot cooler than we thought it was going to be. It's a very nice airport, just very, very busy. These are the flights flying out of here today. It's Orlando, there's a Frontier one. Maybe we have weather in Orlando because that one was delayed too. That could be a thing. Probably is. Let's check. Honestly, that might be it, why it's delayed. Tampa's not delayed though. No, we don't have any weather. It's cloudy. I don't think weather is the issue. I have an idea. I think one day Kyle and I should go to the airport with packed bags not knowing where we're gonna go and then we should just like buy one of the first planes to get out. Should we do that? That'd be cool, that'd be like, what are the, what are the options? At least we'd have options, you know? They'd like give us the options on, though. it'd be cool, I'd make a good vlog. Let us know we should do that. I've I kinda like wanted, that. I've always wanted to do that. I think that'd be so fun. So you don't know where you're gonna go, but then also. You gotta pack for cold and warm. But then we wouldn't have a place to stay. No, you just find a place. Not that hard to okay. find a place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's always rooms available. Oh, there's our gate. Gate 58, we'll see you in approximately two hours. We have learned, well, I've learned, I love Tahim. It's $119? No, that's in pesos. Okay, I was going to say. <laughs> Tahim is amazing. We're addicted to Tahim. For as packed as the airport is, there's actually a lot of seats available. Doesn't look like they have charging with theirs, but what in the world is this? They have an F1 simulator in an airport. That's cool. Except I don't think I'd want a lot of people staring at me if I make a mistake. Never seen that in an airport before. Do you want that for Christmas? Sure. <laughs> sure. Cool. Let me know how much how, let me know how much that is. Probably out of my price range. Air Margaritaville. Get it cuz we're in the airport. Looks like they do have uh, some uh, recharge stations, but not too many. It's always interesting at going to like different countries, airports, or national terminals. This is like what, my second one? Second or third one? I think it's second or third one. Also, they have they have three Starbucks in this airport. We gotta get a We Are Here mug from Starbucks, so we're gonna get a Cancun. We could get the Playa de Carmen too, because we were there as well. 
Even though this isn't our like, first place that we've traveled to together, we want to start collecting the You Are Here mugs from Starbucks. We're going to try the Wolfgang Puck Kitchen. What's the situation? So there's two different vibes we could go with right now. We could do chicken wings with french fries, or we could get a pizza. And quite frankly, I feel like the pizza might be better here. So should we go with pizza? Yeah. Okay, the camera speaks. When in Mexico, always do bottled water. Our uh, flight just got delayed another half hour, departing now at 4.11. We're gonna get comfy in these seats because we're gonna need to. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh yeah, I just did that, wow. Margarita pizza. This pizza's good. Fun fact, I didn't even wanna eat. I didn't even wanna eat. Plane just got delayed again. Here we go. By like 15 more minutes, 20 more minutes. I will say there's this really cool feature to see where your plane is. And at least they're taxiing, so they're on their way pretty much soon, so we shouldn't have too many more delays. Our plane just took off, so we should have no more delays from here on out. Oh, 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 here she goes, trying to get somebody. Here she goes, take this, take this. Oh, she didn't fall for the trap. Where is she? Nope. Oh, come follow me. <laughs> Look at that. This girl's so good. She's so good. She just keeps getting the come. Come try this product. She seriously took the yeah. lotion or whatever it was. And like took it out of her hand. Yeah. She was like, here you fall. <laughs> took it away. And made her get in the yeah. seat. But okay. the thing is they they're targeting older women. I don't know if it, like if that's what the cream's for or what, but it, it seems like the women are the ones that fall for the trap. Well I really the older women. I thought he that Kyle was being a little crazy. No. Like, I just you have to watch this and I I've, was I was in my own wall of land just I've a little bit. Watching ago, this forever. He has got a point. This is so entertaining. Yes. Guys, you're in the airport, just watch this because it's so funny how these people just grab them. I mean, you guys just saw it. It is, is so good. fascinating. That girl is good. She's good. She's good. It's like, honey, what took so long? Sorry, I bought some cream. <laughs> oh, I think she's buying it. She's buying it, yeah. Look, here it goes. See, they always go for the older women. Always. Come here, come here. Oh, she gonna get it? She gonna get it? Yeah, follow me. Look at it. Yeah. Look at that. It's so good. Every time. Always the older woman. Try it on. There we go. Our gate actually changed. Let's go to it. We're actually gonna be going past those people who have been handing out things. So I'm gonna keep it rolling to see what happens when we're vlogging. I don't think they're gonna do anything. They're gonna do nothing. Absolutely nothing. I think we're good. We're good to go. Just like that. Follow the camera in here. You're a okay. <laughs> well, I was going along with it. I was ready. We did it. Someone also just said to Kyle like he was Mr. Beast. <laughs> Gate 65. Let us on. It is time to go home. And just like that, our plane has arrived. I mean. In the grand scheme of things, we're only delayed about an hour here, so it's not horrendous. And we're on. Wait till you guys see your seats on this flight. <laughs> Thank you, La Machia Travel. You guys rock. Link will be down below. Bing bada bing bada boom. Hello. Our spots are right here. Check out this JetBlue one. This time they've got like a, a clear glass. This is cool. Extra leg room. I'll take that. I actually put my computer here too, so that's nice. Interview is everybody boring right now. It's so good to be on the plane. We were at the airport for I, I want to say at least three and a half hours. But the good thing is yeah. it's it's under that's two it. hours. This is going to be an easy flight, pretty much up and down, because that's what a plane does, up and down. Thank you. Thank you. This is cool. I feel like I'm not enclosed with this little glass thing here. I kind of dig that aspect. Well, 
Our flight is an hour and 25 minutes. That is a breeze. Oh, I always love when you can just see Magic Kingdom from the air as you're flying on in. It's that orange glow. And we're back. Let's go get a global entry. Gotta walk up to, to customs. This is what I thought we were gonna do. We came back and I was right. Customs are like on the fifth floor. Here we go. It's about a seven minute walk. So now the big question is where exactly we go for global entry. I think there's gonna be a sign that tells us where to go. I mean, usually that's how it works. Yay, the end of the carpet. Woo! If you fly international, Trust us, it's a it's a really long walk, but it's a fun walk. Okay, you approved for glo glo global entry. Let an officer know and we will complete your global entry interview today. All right, cool. That looks familiar. We saw you about a week ago, or more than a week ago. Look at this, it's the airport of the future. These ceilings are crazy. Whew. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it looks like you get your bags and then, yeah. Yeah, that's nice. You can kind of like get in line for real. Oh wow, there's like nobody here for global entry, meaning line to get back into regular land. But let's go find out where we have to go. Just gotta ask one of them, I believe. And we're through. Somehow we lucked out with absolutely nobody being in line. And as soon as we kind of just got done, a huge crowd of people just came. He's like, oh, just wait, everything's delayed in four hours, in like two hours, it's gonna be 45 to an hour wait. Really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't, he didn't tell me that. Yeah, well, that, that was, not that guy, I was talking to somebody else where yeah, we, we were getting yeah. Oh, okay. okay. It's like about 15 minutes each person, even yeah. probably faster than that. A couple questions. Easy. Bing bada boom. Yeah. In case you already got approved, I didn't check mine yet, but I'm sure yeah. I got approved as well. I went and interviewed first. It was yeah. very easy process here. Um, you just go through the same line you do to go through um, the customs and border control anyway. You just tell the officer that you got initially approved if you did, after you do the application online, and then they just do it right then and there. So it's not like a separate line or anything, which I was expecting it to be separate, but I feel like a huge wave, like weight is lifted off my shoulders because I've been like, oh my gosh, I still need to do my interview. Oh my gosh, I still need to do it. And I haven't been able to get She's nervous. Interview. She was nervous, but she's I, got TSA pre. Yeah. We both got global and TSA Heck pre yes. now. Let's go. Where I should we wait, go? I can't wait to, for TSA next time. Where should we go, guys? Yeah, let's book a flight. Let's book a flight. We gotta go somewhere. I don't know. This was great. I mean, it's what? I don't even think it's 8 o'clock yet. No, it's, it's only, only 7. seven. That was, I was expecting to be out of here at like 8. I was expecting this to take way longer than it did, but we're back here in Orlando. I don't know what adventures are coming tomorrow. We'll see. We're, we're just kind of gonna see what we, we feel like doing. It's Christmas year now. We gotta cover Christmas here at Disney, but... Thank you guys so much for uh, supporting this series. Thank you, Star. Thank you, La Machia Travel, for having us out. You guys are amazing, and um, thank you guys. We love you, and that's it. We're back. We're back after a long stretch. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Let's get a lift.